Did you know Excel can be used to plan agile sprints or time box iterations in project management? In this video, we'll create and share a lightweight agile framework in Excel with three easy steps. Sprint planning based on work velocity forecasts, sprint allocation based on the backlog of user stories, and drawing bare known charts for remaining story points after sprints. You can follow along by getting the Excel workbook via the provided link in the description below. Step 1 is sprint planning based on work velocity. Our case study focuses on a development team with a backlog of 16 user stories. Based on the work volume and complexity, our Scrum Master has assigned story points. Our aim as the product owner is to plan four sprints to clear the work backlog of 120 story points. Initial work velocity forecasts are made based on our team's capacity. The development team improves its performance in later sprints by becoming more familiar with project processes. In real projects, a combination of improved productivity and additional overtime work can contribute to velocity increases. The final work velocity is found by applying velocity increase percentages. For example, final velocity of a sprint 2 will be 20 times 1 plus 20 percent, which is 24 story points. We can find the total story points completed at the end of each sprint by summing of final velocities. Step 2 is sprint allocation based on the backlog of user stories. We now need to allocate the story points or work backlog to each sprint based on the relevant velocity. For example, if sprint 1 can handle 20 story points, we can allocate the stories 1 to 4 whose points sum to 20. In the same way, we can allocate backlog work to sprints 2, 3, and 4. Our planning for 4 sprints can clear the work backlog for user stories 1 to 14. Stories 15 and 16 will be the remaining backlog after the 4 sprints. Step 3 is drawing burn down charts for remaining story points. We can easily draw burn down chart for the project to show remaining story points after each sprint. This visualizes team's progress towards completing work backlog by the four planned sprints. Remaining points after sprint 1 is 120 minus 20, which is 100. We can duplicate the formula to find the remaining points of 76, 46, and 13 after the later sprints. A line graph can be used to plot the burn down chart. We can customize the style to suit our project reports. And here it is, an easy and short implementation of Agile methodology using only three simple steps in Microsoft Excel. If you found this video useful, please consider subscribing. I hope to have your comments and see you in the next one.